I'm going to tell you this one important thing, and I want you to understand this. Only a man who recognizes his worth that would recognize your worth. Let me explain. A lot of you all are struggling still because you have, you have relationships now where somebody disrespects you, somebody's abusive towards you, somebody don't like you, or you just left a relationship where a man was treating you badly. Understand this. The reason was not because of you. See, I only love you the way how I love. It's not about you. I only treat you the way how I treat myself. It's not about you. I'm only with you how the way how I am with myself. Conditional. See, I conditionally love myself. So I can only conditionally love you. If you do something right, I might love you. Understand this. If I do something right, I might like me then. But when I stop doing right, I take away the love for myself. I stop loving myself. So people only treat you according to how they see themselves. So when a man don't recognize your worth, it's because he don't recognize his. That's the issue. It's not about him not recognizing your worth. That's the issue. Some of you all right now are hating a man because he never saw you. Well, how can you hate a man who never saw himself? See, a man who recognizes his worth, see how powerful he is, see how strong he is. He understands his connection between him and God. He understands that the creator made him with his hands. He understands his value towards the creator. Why would the creator make me for no reason? When a man understands this, when he looks at you, he sees the same exact thing. Remember, when we look at something outside, all we are doing is projecting our inside. Whatever we look at is ourselves. We don't see anything else. Nothing else exists. When you look from your eyes, your eyes are only seeing what your mind is registering. So when a man disrespects you and treats you bad and this and that, understand that man doesn't recognize his own value. You can't hate somebody for not seeing themselves. You teach them about themselves. But sometimes you have to separate yourself. Somebody who is not sick don't spread germs. Somebody who is not sick don't uh, infect people. Only a sick person infects others. The reason why you are infected is because you have messed with a sick person. It seems like he has moved on and is happy now. And no, he's not. He's still sick. He just don't see his symptoms. A man who recognizes himself will recognize you. The reason why you can't find somebody who cherishes you is because you are not focused on somebody who cherishes themselves. Find somebody who walks with themselves. Somebody who is uh, connected to themselves. Find somebody who understands themselves. Find somebody who already been through the journey of healing. Because when he sees himself, he sees you. And when he sees you, he sees himself. Hope that helps you.